Dan, not only for all the work, but for this sense of Menschlichkeit with which you do it. I really appreciate it. So if you don't want to participate in the service next year and you don't want to go to any of the educational components, <laughs> there are plenty of ways for you to volunteer at KI. If you have two hours a week, two hours a month, an hour a year, uh, we can find something for you to do. Um, I'd like any trustees who are here to stand up for a second. Stand up. Um, Maybe you want to work with foster kids in Roseanne, or this, wave Roseanne, or um, Miriam and the seniors. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Cindy with membership. <laughs> We've got Rachel, membership acquisition. If you want to be acquired as a member, you can also see her. Uh, Bert whose religious practices, okay, you'll get, and there's so many more things to do, tikkun olam, and um, just, uh, we have a volunteer coordinator, Sherry German, you can call her at the office, and uh, we hope you'll do that. Um, so it's the day of awe, days of awe, and um, I am in awe of this embarrassment of clerical riches, is that an expression? So I, I wanna take this opportunity to thank you all for loving us and for creating such a beautiful High Holiday experience. <laughs> and um, I know next week is difficult, so please get plenty of rest. <laughs> Take a lot of vitamin C, yes, <laughs> comfortable <laughs> shoes, and uh, thank you, thank you. Thank you all, Happy New Year. I, of course, want to echo those wonderful sentiments. We're so fortunate to have such wonderful clergy, cantor, guest cantor, cantor emeritus, fantastic choir. And again, thanks to Jake today for uh, introducing himself to us. I'm very tempted to ask him who won the Dodger game. but I'm <laughs> However, I wonder whether that's really the point. <laughs> Nevertheless, who won? <laughs> ah, he's not going to tell us. Somebody, the Dodgers, the Dodgers won. Uh, not the Red Sox. Not the Red Sox. Um, I, uh, I'm actually here to invite everyone uh, to come and join us uh, the first Saturday of every month uh, if for a Shabbat minion that we have here that is lay-led. If you like the service today, if this is the kind of thing that you really like, warm, Hamish, participatory, you will love our Saturday Minion. Uh, it's at 10.30, the first Saturday of every month. We generally have, it's in the chapel, right on the other side of this wall. We generally have between 15 and 30 people. Um, you can hear the chanting of Mickey. Um, I do some leading. Uh, the coordinators of our Minion, uh, Dana and Carol, are here, and uh, they help, and Gary Corman, Gary, where's Gary? There's Gary, is our Gabi. Uh, he leads the Torah service. We try and have people participate as they wish, so people can read English, people can read Hebrew if they wish. Uh, I think all the Hebrew, 100% of the Hebrew that we have is also in transliteration in our Siddur, so you don't have to be able to read Hebrew. Uh, we are very fortunate to have the help and participation of Rabbi Hanish who generally starts off with a five or a 10 minute teaching, generally something about prayer. One of our uh, Minion people volunteers, a different one every month. We do a small drosh, we take out the Torah. If you haven't touched a Torah lately, if you haven't gathered around a Torah, it really is, uh, as one of our uh, congregants said, a real Hamish Shabbos. It's a time to get together. So it's the first Saturday uh, of every month. At 10.30, uh, there's, of course, our wonderful weekly Torah study, which is led by our rabbis. That goes from 9 to 10. At 10.30, we begin. You are welcome. And then uh, we finish off around noon or 12.15,
And then we have a uh, dairy potluck lunch, which is a great time to sit down and enjoy a nice Shabbos meal. So, Shana Tova, everyone, and we hope to see you. Remember that date, October 3rd, 1030. We uh, more or so beautifully um, mentioned again about our executive director, but uh, Marka has an incredible army of people doing the work. And there's one person I want to um, mention today who's here who is on the front lines of making sure that all of us have the tickets and all of us, has, all of us have the appropriate information, and that's Masha Fleissig. Masha, thank you, Masha, for everything. In a few minutes when you're exiting, there's a table outside the sanctuary filled with information about KI activities and KI happenings. We'd like to quickly mention a couple. We have the new KI Tunes, a website filled with music done by this congregation, um, and it was sponsored by the, the, Z the Zaretskis, the Zaretsky family, in honor of their son, Dylan. We also have the um, LA Clippers, um, Maccabi, Tel Aviv Maccabi in it. Um, basketball came in, coming up at Staples Center. Uh, thank you. Tuesday, October 20th. And we'd love to have everyone there. Our own cantor will be singing the national anthem. So it'll be a wonderful, wonderful evening of Judaism and basketball. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Can't beat that, can you? Yeah. And Stephen, are you doing the sermon during halftime? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> And Cheryl will be doing the closing benediction at the basketball game. So it's, it'll be a perfect evening. <laughs> In a moment, we'll recite the Mourner's Kaddish, found on page 1216. In reciting the Kaddish, we affirm the where, our awareness of holiness in our world. Much of our experience of divine goodness and grace and love has come to us through those whose lives have touched our own. We invoke the transcendent power of love and caring as we sanctify God's name. If you're in a state of mourning or observing a, a shiva, observing a yurt site, please state the name of your beloved as my hand crosses the kahal. Betty Chutko, I'd like everyone who's in the first year of mourning to please rise first. Those who are observing a yort site, please rise next. And then as a community, may the rest of us rise in support of our mourners. The cottage is on page 1216. Yitkadal v'yitkadash shmei rabba v'alma divra chirute v'amlik malchute v'chay echon v'yom echon v'chay dechol beit Yisrael v'agala v'izman kari v'imru amen yehe shmei rabba mevarach le'olam ulamei amaya yitbarach v'yishtabach v'yitpaar v'yitromam v'yitnase v'yitadar v'yitale v'yitalal shmei dekudsha b'rechu Leila, Leila, Mikol Birchata Veshirata, Tush Bechata Venechamata, Damiran Beama Vimru Amen, Yehe Shlama Rabba Min Shmaya, Vechayim Aleinu Veako Yisrael Vimru Amen, O Se Shalom Bimromav, Huya Se Shalom, Aleinu Veako Yisrael, Veako Yosve Tevel Vimru Amen. May the one who creates harmony above make peace for us, for all Israel, and for all humankind. And with that we say, Amen. Amen. So before we come to our closing song, and you might as well stay up. I, you know, soon you're going to go and eat. It'll be good. Uh, a blessing, a closing blessing for this Rosh Hashanah. May peace reign over our country and throughout the world. May you enjoy your apples and honey. May you find it easy to give and receive. May you know when to surrender 
and do so with grace. May you remember 